hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel i hope that you are doing well so this is our third part from the social series okay so earlier to this i have already made two videos okay on the chapters indian physiography and indian climate so this is the chapter indian soils okay so let us discuss some important multiple choice questions which are important for your sslc exam 2021 okay so if you are new to this channel kindly do subscribe the channel and don't forget to like comment and share the video okay so let us start with our first question yes you can see it here i will try to cover the whole chapter with the help of these multiple choice questions okay so this is our first question agricultural production is basically dependent on dash of the soil so soil should be what it should be fertile okay that is the main requirement here they have given the options availability fertility rock or none of the above the answer is what option number b fertility okay going to question number 2 the sediments that are deposited by the rivers are called as what okay they are called as alluvium in the soil formed by this alluvium is called as alluvial soil we have studied this in our first chapter okay and sorry second chapter indian uh, physiography there the northern great plains are mainly formed of what alluvial soil only okay so they are mainly deposited by rivers okay they are called as alluvium in the soil from it is alluvium soil alluvial soil next moving to question number 3 here it says black cotton soil is also called as dash so what do we call black cotton soil as it is also called as reger soil okay you have to remember this black cotton soil is also called as just black soil or reger soil okay next question number 4 the soil which is derived from basalt okay due to the weathering of basalt what is basalt it is a rock okay so due to the weathering of this rock we get the soil which soil basalt b for basalt b for black soil so option number d is the right choice you should also remember about red alluvial and desert so red soil are mainly formed by which one granite or gneiss you have to remember this from the rock granite and gneiss okay what about alluvial soil just now we saw it is because of the sediments okay or alluvium okay and uh, desert soil they are mainly sand okay next moving to question number 5 which among the following is not a property of red soil okay so here they have given four properties so which is not a property of red soil you have to tick it that okay cannot retain moisture no this is the property it cannot retain this is correct property reddish brown in color this is also right it is sandier okay so this is also right more clay no this is not more clay it is a less clay soil okay in the properties you might have seen so answer is this one option number d okay you should remember the properties of other soils also okay based on that they can ask the questions next is question number 6 which among the following is a leached soil okay leached soil means the top layer of the soil will be removed okay the soil on which the top layer is lost its fertile soil is lost that we that soil is called as leached soil so which among these is the right answer red desert laterite or mountain so it is laterite soil okay it is not suitable for agriculture because its fertility is lost okay they are mainly used for the uh, construction work like for construction of bricks and all tiles they are used okay so remember this laterite soil next moving to question number 7 a soil with high content of soluble salt and sandy okay they are high they have high content of soluble salt and sandy okay these two properties belongs to which soil it's mainly desert soil okay they are 
sin d okay you have seen that construction work they use the red color or uh, reddish brown color they are called as sand so this desert soil okay are mainly soluble they have high content of soluble salt and they are also sandy okay option number c is the right answer next is question number eight the soil formed due to the decomposition of organic matter okay so decomposition of organic matter which soil is that so it is mainly yes you guessed it right it is option number a mountain soil okay remember this they are mainly formed on the slopes of mountains okay and peaks next is question number nine soil erosion is one of the dash for the agriculture in india okay so you must know the meaning of soil erosion it is the removal of top most layer of the soil because of that fertility will be lost so it is not good for agriculture so therefore it is a problem of india okay it is one of the problem for the agriculture in india it's not an advantage or helpful it is a problem so you have to remember this soil erosion is a problem next is and what will be the solution to this soil erosion can you tell me the answer take it as homework okay in the comment section you can write solution to soil erosion and write the answer it's there in the textbook only okay moving to question number 10 now which among the following is not a cause of soil erosion cause cause means the reasons of soil erosion so which among these are not the cause overgrazing it is a cause afforestation it is not a cause deforestation means removal of forest so it is also a cause shifting it all it is also a cause a cause so only cause which is not the only option which is not a cause of soil erosion is or forestation it means planting of trees so it helps okay in preventing soil erosion so this is good okay next is good for soil i mean next is question number 11 here they have asked ground water level increases due to soil erosion okay so ground water level increases due to soil erosion the above statement is so soil erosion does it help to improve the water level ground water level no it not increases actually it decreases the soil erosion as well as the fertility of soil so the statement is false option number b is the right choice next is question number 13 preservation of fertility of soil is called as dash okay preservation of fertility of soil what do we call it as we call it as soil conservation option number c is the correct answer okay you should also remember the measures for soil conservation okay next question bench terracing helps in dash okay so i will give this as a homework for you okay without looking in the comment section without looking for the answer in the comment section type your answer okay if you know it also take this question as homework don't look for the answers in comment section solve it by yourself contour farming is a dash of soil erosion what is contour farming whether it is a cause of soil erosion remedy effect or none of the above so you have to answer three questions okay which i have given as homework i hope and before that let me tell it is a very small chapter okay and even easy the geography part from the whole social science is very easy okay so i hope you liked it okay i have tried to cover all the topics and all the all the type of questions that could be asked from this chapter okay so practice them well okay we'll meet you all in the next video till then take care bye and don't forget to subscribe and share the video subscribe the channel okay see you all